My name is Emily Kern, Math Instructional Coach in Austin, Texas. Let's explore how to find the surface area and volume of prisms and pyramids. You can think of surface area as the amount of paper it would take to completely wrap a 3D figure. It's area, which means that we measure in square units. There are two ways to find the surface area of a prism. One would be to find the area of all of the faces and add them up. The other way to find the surface area of a prism is to use the formula S equals capital PH plus 2B, where P represents the perimeter of the base and B represents the area of the base. You can use the formula V equals BH, where B represents the area of the base of the prism and H represents the height of the prism. You can think about it as finding the area of the base and then multiplying it by the number of layers there are, that's the height. A pyramid is different from a prism because it only has one base and it goes to a vertex at the top as opposed to a prism which has two bases. To find the surface area of the pyramid, you can find the area of all of the faces and add them up. So that would in this case be four triangles plus a square the other way to find the surface area of a pyramid is to use the formula S equals 1 half PL plus B, where P represents the perimeter of the base, L represents the slant height, and B represents the area of the base. Mm -hmm.